News3now.com. And when we hit the roads during the winter like that, a lot of them uh, are made safer by our snowplow drivers. Eyewitness News 3's Adrian Luevano shows us what their process is like. When it's, it's snowing heavy, you know, it's kind of cool to watch the snow come out the chutes, you know, so we just plow and plow and plow until it stops. When the roads look like this, Idaho Transportation Department snow plow driver Carlos Garcia makes sure his truck is loaded with 200 gallons of brine and hundreds of pounds of salt. A lot of us get the mindset that we want the road safe. So we, we plow as hard and as heavy as we have to to keep the snow off the roads and keep the roads as safe as possible for the uh, pedestrians and the drivers. Snowplow drivers on Highway 20 usually plow 25 miles in each direction. Garcia says when they are plowing, drivers need to keep their distance and avoid passing them on their right. So if you need to pass, wait till it's safe. You know, if the roads are pretty bad, we'll keep you back there just to help drive the salt into the snow, which breaks it up faster, and it helps us out as well as the public. His number one tip if you're driving in snow like on Wednesday is to slow down. You know, the roads are slick. Even though we're out plowing them, they're still slick. You know, sometimes there'll be ice underneath the snow, and it's black ice, so you ain't going to know if it's going to wet, if it's wet or if it's dry, you know, icy. So, you know, just slow down. In Sugar City, I'm Adrian Luevano. And it's best to give them plenty of room to do their work. And so while Carlos was busy plowing the highway, Chief Meteorologist Michael Coates was tracking the storm. Michael? Mm -hmm. 